Hello everybody, this is Nitin Pato here and welcome to part 5 of solving the Fourier cube. The edge parity. Okay, so let's start with it. And before that, I'll give you one situation in the Fourier cube. Okay, so uh, first we'll go for the 3 by 3 what situation I'm giving before the 4 by 4. And the situation is that after making the first layer okay this is the first layer and this is the second layer okay we are gonna make a cross the cross okay we are gonna make a cross so we'll get sometimes l sometimes we'll get only the centerpiece okay and sometimes we'll get a horizontal line so for that we'll do the algorithm f r u r u f we got a horizontal line and again i'll do that and we got a cross okay but for 4 by 4 what thing is there what situation that is parity which uh, it is a situation that where uh, you did get a l also not a line also and not only the center pieces here if you try to do that algorithm also f r u i inverted u inverted f but you will not get your cross see i'll do that f r u i inverted u inverted f you can see that i didn't get a cross i got a horizontal line at this piece this piece is opposite uh, line okay means this piece should be opposite this blue should be like this and orange should be this side so we are going to do a particular algorithm for solving this parity this parity is called edge parity okay so i'll show you the algorithm please note it down before doing that i'll give you 10 seconds At 10 seconds over let's do the algorithm and here we go so before doing the algorithm i will teach you what is the algorithm means the, uh, capital r means outer layer okay smaller r means inner layer okay any alphabet which we are using for rubik's cubes okay so for four by four it's little different which capital letters will be outer layers at smaller letters will be inner layer so there what a uh, case was there are smaller r inverted which this inner layer this is right inner layer this is left inner layer this layer and this left outer layer this is right outer layer okay so it, it is for all you also be also everything okay so let's do the algorithm and here we go r okay right inner layer inverted okay only inner layer then u outer layer 180 degrees the left inner layer clockwise this is the left inner layer and the front two times clockwise f2 then again left inner layer and d clockwise the front two times right inner layer two times then upside two times right inner layer ones upside two types right inner layer inverted upside two types front twice right inner layer twice and front twice and now we can see that we got the completely got the cross so this algorithm we have to do at the place where the edge should be turned properly okay so we have got the cross and let's go for the alliteration of the pieces okay and if you have to know the three by three algorithms like that f r u r inverted u inverted f please watch my three by three videos for that and let's go for the alliteration of the edges edges aligned the condition is that sometimes you'll get two opposite edges aligned at adjacent so we got adjacent we have to keep them on the right side okay these two are the to keep them on the right side and do the algorithm r u i voted u the algorithm okay r u i voted u r u two i voted and now we can see that we got all the edges aligned okay so this much for this video thanks for watching my video and see you soon in my other parts